Hello there, I am Giant Grove from our Pokemon Mission Dungeon for Rescue Team. In the last part, we took on the, um, we got a rescue mission, which was a weird rescue mission, saying punch bad mankeys. And now we have to go to that poor forest and settle down this mankey gang. Um, I have, I think I have Absol with me still. Yep, okay. Um, items, I should be good on items. Let's just take on the poor forest. And let's go. Now, the upper forest, as I said, is 10 floors. It's like a mount steel, basically, except for one extra floor. It's kind of that difficulty level. There's a lot of, bug there's a lot of grass and bug type Pokemon, as I said before. So if you're a fire type, this this dungeon is just, like, really easy. And if your partner's a fire type, that's really good. In fact, I should switch up my moves. Um, let me go through my team again. Um, there's also um, Apom in this dungeon, and then, of course, the Mankey. Um, Mankey is also in this dungeon. So, let me see, moves, oh, okay, that's fine, and Ace should be fine on his moves, there we go, um, I need to set a different move other than Water Gun, really, um, let's try Bite then, yeah, there we go, let's continue on, Petra Berry, Blast Seed, cool, and into Cherry Berry, nice, ah, oh, dead end, of course, <laughs> okay, Let's go down. Hopefully my judgment's with me. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we're going to the stairs. Other than that, um, also I should mention that um, there's a new thing in these dungeons from the upper forest to present, uh, to the future dungeons that we're going to face, face I should say. Um, there's these things called monster houses where if you step in a room, like a little section like where I'm at with the stairs is right now and there's a lot of items there's a big chance you're gonna um, run into monster houses which will be like 10 enemies and you have to fight them all or escape and it's really hard because they'll attack you and stuff um, but a way to uh, know if there's one um, there's me really going idle with the menu being paused but the way the only way you can really tell if the monster house is nearby is if you have like at this I think it's an x-ray specs or something as a held item and it, it'll show you like w avoid rooms with lots of items or stat changing panels, tiles, whatever they're called. So keep that in mind. Um, so that's something new in these dungeons. So other than that, music time. Okay, when you reach the ninth floor, do not go right to the steps when you find them, because there's this there's this new item called the chestnut, where um you need a ha it's good if you can find two chestnuts on the ninth floor on your first try. If not, you're gonna have to come back, cause you need three to progress in the game, and we'll get to the third one later or whatever not. See, like there's the stairs right there, but you wanna explore every inch of this floor, and it's only in the ninth floor where you can find these chestnuts. Also, I should have mentioned that um, I put text overlay over. Ooh, there's just another corner. Cool. I put text overlay um, before I started the music and everything, saying that the weather conditions, like on the second floor, it said it was sunny. That that um, when it's sunny, um, your water type moves. If you have any water type moves, like I do, like water gun, um, then um, your um, your water type moves will be weakened because it's sunny out. Just like in the regular Pokemon game, sunny day. Um, when when it's sunny out, or sunlight is shining, whatever. Um, your water type moves are, um, get, get a little, um, weaker, because it's sunny out. Hopefully I explained that correctly. Or, where it made, or at least where it made sense. So if I can find another chestnut, that'd be great. If not, I have to come back and get one, which I really don't want to do if I don't have to. Which it looks like I'm going to have to. There's that seed out using nature power, which is earthquake. The first time I played this game, I was so I was like, "How? Wait, how does that seed out know earthquake?" But then I remembered it's nature power that turns into earthquake. So let's just take out this nuzzle leaf, and we just took out that mink, I believe. So, yeah. I I think I'm gonna have to come back because yeah, it looks like unless unless that little corner on the top left top right corner of the map is where another chestnut is 
Other than that, I'm probably gonna have to come back. So, yeah. Uh, looks like it's a roundabout. Ooh, it goes around. Yep, I knew it. Called it. Well, looks like I'm gonna have to come back, because as I'm looking at the map right now... Yep. Just my luck. Usually I never find two chestnuts on the ninth floor on the first try anyway. Let's go to the 10th floor then. Okay. So here's some manky. Huh? W what is it, you? We don't like to brag or ain't nothing, but we got furious really easily. You know what? What really irritates us is when we see some dim-witted face. Oh, that's not very nice. You guys have a funny face too. Roar. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That, uh, I'm gonna skip through your dialogue. Sorry, I skipped through half your dialogue there. I'm tick. It's ticking me off. I'm seeing red. You're itching for a fight. You're angry, I should say, actually. Minky, get him. It's frenzy time. Now, this boss fight is a joke. Because you can like one shot these mankeys. I'm gonna try using bubble and let's see if it one shots. I know if I use water gun, it's like a guaranteed one hit KO if it hits. So let's see what water, what's, what a bubble does. That just knocks out one third of the team. And I'm gonna use another bubble. There we go, two of them down. And let's finish this one with a water gun. It was that easy. Seriously, it was that easy. That's all you had to do. Pretty easy fight. Like we promised, we showed the minky gang they shouldn't monkey around <laughs> they should that should teach him not to be so wild everyone thank you for everything really wow buffet yes we're filled with gratitude this is our thanks we get chestnuts and so now we have two chestnuts we need you need three chestnuts in order to predict progress in the game i'm gonna have to go back for one so yeah we'll get to that later though it's actually very very soon in the same part probably this is a peeled chestnut yes it's a peeled chestnut yes yeah, you see we don't have any money. Okay, so that's okay. I mean, chestnuts are pretty cool, I guess. Wobbuffet. So we can only give you a chestnut as a reward. Are you unhappy? Nah. Um, no, no. We're fine with this. Pure chestnuts are delicious. I think they're great. Ha, uh, a little money would have been nice. Okay, <laughs> you say that to yourself, Cody. Yeah. Hey, you. Oh, look, it's the Mankey Gang. Oh, uh, oh no. The Mankey Gang. Wobbuffet. That Minky game. Did they chase us here to get us back? We can take them on again. They're easy. We def I, I single-handedly defeated them myself. I didn't even need Absol or Cody's help. Well, Cody and Absol didn't even get a chance to attack, but still. That's right, you. You got lucky. Don't mess with us. We're not gonna lose this time. We're we'll pulverize you. How about we pulverize you again? Because that's not gonna happen in your case. Minky, crush them. We got it. We flinch and um, yeah, we flinch. Whoa! Look at that, chestnut, ch chestnut. It is a peel. It's a peeled chestnut. What? What? Whisper, whisper, mutter, mutter. What are they talking about? What are they doing? They, they look like they're having a discussion. Wow, buffet. What's going on? Uh, listen. Uh, you got something we want. That peeled chestnut you have. Can we have it? Uh, we, uh, love peeled chestnut, like we love them so much. <coughs> I had to clear my throat there. <coughs> the <coughs> yeah, now it's cleared. Okay, so, um, like we said, like we, like we love them so much, we can't think of life without chestnuts. Can't you just get chestnuts by yourself? Do you know how chestnuts have they, that spiky shell? Trying to peel that spiky shell, it hurts, and we end up losing our tempers. That's why we're asking, give us that peeled chestnut. We'll do whatever you want. Hmm, Stephen, what do you think? Should we give him the peeled chestnut to the Minky Gang? Sure, why not? I know. Listen, Minky Gang, how are you with physical labor? Physical labor? You mean muscle work? We have muscles, but we don't like work. But if it's for that peeled chestnut, okay, this is what we'll do. Um, we will go. We're go we were going to make a rescue team base something more impressive than this. Rescue team base? That's right, our rescue team base. If you would help us with the building in our rescue team base, we could give you that spill chestnut. How does that sound? Whisper, whisper, mutter, mutter. They're doing it again. They're doing it again, man. Okay, we'll help. Really? You'll help us? 
Yeah, leave it to us. We'll carry the materials and get the place built double quick. In return, hand over that peeled chestnut. Okay, we'll do it, we'll do it. Me too, I want to help, I'll help too. I'll, so, I'll spit silk for gluing things together. Cool. I'll help too. Wobbuffet. I felt bad because we only had a peeled chestnut for your reward. Wobbuffet. Sniff, thanks everyone. Look at Cody's eyes just light up. Okay, let's get a move on. Okay. Okay. <laughs> they all say okay. Pose. And so. Construction work began on the rescue team base of Steven's team, Grodel. Several days later. It looks half finished, but we're doing great. It's awesome. Good work, guys. Keep it up. Phew. Our base is coming along quickly. Wobbuffet. We owe every everyone for this. Wobbuffet. But there's still lots to do. We still have difficult things to do. Wobbuffet. That's true. But where are the... We're, but we're getting close, right? Minky gang? Huh? Looking around. Where are the Minky gang? Where'd they go? Look over there. Uh, they look like they're on strike. They don't want to work anymore right now. <laughs> What's the matter? We need to keep working. Don't wanna. Oh, shocked? What? That works. This works too boring. How can you expect us to keep going? Yeah, that's right. I don't wanna do this anymore. We might change our minds if you give us more peeled chestnuts. Okay, if that's what you want. What is this about? We just can't be bothered. We just can't be bothered. We need peeled chestnuts to motivate us. We have a problem, Steven. I don't think the Banky Gang will work unless we get them another peeled chestnut. <coughs> <coughs> I had to clear my throat again. Okay, cool. I guess we have to give the Banky Gang any peeled chestnuts that we find. We need three. We have one more, I guess. But yeah, you can save your game, which I'm going to do now. Why not? I'm just going to save on screen for once. Good morning, Steven. Okay, um, we're gonna give the Mankey our second peeled chestnut right now. I'm gonna give it to us. Give. And if you don't give it to them, I think they'll attack you, which is, I don't think they'll hurt you or anything, but they'll like attack you or something. Um, yeah, a peeled chestnut. Yes, a peeled chestnut. Alright, you lay about. Get it together. Chop, chop. Why don't you quit lounging around yourself? Get moving. We'll get hustling on re renovating your rescue team base. We'll carry in the materials and get the place built double quick. You just wait. And so, s supplied with another peel chestnut, the Minky King got motivated and returned to work on the rescue team base's renovation. As a result, the rescue team base's completion moved a little closer. So, um, it looks about the same, but you know, um, I'm going to cut to where I find another peeled chestnut in the upper forest. I need to find one more. You need a total of three. You're giving one You're giving one as a reward again, as I said before, by Wana and Wobbuffet. So you need to find two in the upper forest on the ninth floor. I'm going to cut to the ninth floor, and hopefully I can find one last chestnut to advance in the game. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, so here we are on the ninth floor again. Hopefully we can find one chestnut on this floor. Again, just explore all you can on this floor. And... You'll do good. I just realized, like, at the beginning, when I first, on the first floor, that I didn't bring Apso with me this time around. But, um, that's okay. I was just trying to, you know, try to get, um, my, the third chestnut that I needed. Oh my gosh, we're missing all over the place. There we go. Let's take out this Nuzleaf. I ran out of water guns, so that's why my set move is Bubble right now. And Bubble missed when I was along, which there for a second on the Nuzleaf, which kind of stinks. But we took down the Nuzleaf n n nonetheless. So, if I can find a chestnut, that'd be great. Oh my gosh, if I don't... Come on. There's the stairs right there. Please tell me that's a chestnut. Thank you. It's a chestnut. Okay, I'm, sw I'm swapping it out. I'm swapping it out for something. For like an Petra Berry, I guess, or Cherry Berry. Swap. Just to make sure I want to have... I know I want to just make sure that's in my bag. Chestnut, okay, cool. 
So after that, we can just head to the tenth floor. I don't think the Mankey Gang will be there the second time around because they're I've obviously just in front of a rescue team base. So this little cutscene right here. They're like, um, there seems to be no one here. And whenever you beat like a boss fight, if you go like back to Mount Steel, for example, on the ninth floor, you want to see Skarmory. So this message will probably appear saying, uh, it'll probably, it will appear, um, but maybe not in the same word for word thing. But it says, there appears to be no one here. It's impossible to go and go further. It's time to go back. And you just walk back. And that's that. So yeah. Okay, no one's here anymore, because that's because cutscene. The normal cutscene where I say, see you tomorrow. Cody says, see you tomorrow. Um, other than that, I'm going to stop it right here. So this has been the end of my Pokemon Mystery Engine and Rescue Team Walk the Guide part. And the next part will take on, hopefully, finishing the Rescue Team base with the third and final trust plant that we need. So that's so this has been Janko again. I would like to mention again goodbye. And I'll see you guys in the next part of Pokemon Mystery Engine and Rescue Team Walkthrough Guide.